because what we actually saw here, even though the Fed decided that they were going to reduce their asset purchase program, and I've been saying for a while that I thought that the December meeting would be the meeting at which they begin or they announce that they're going to do a tapering. They're doing a little bit more than what I thought. I thought they would only do $5 billion in treasuries, but they decided to add in their $5 billion in MBSs. But the key thing is what they took with the left hand as far as the taper is they gave with the right with enhanced forward guidance. Effectively, what they're saying is even well after the unemployment rate drops below 6.5%, they expect that they're going to continue to keep the federal funds rate at their current level of about 0%, unless, of course, we see inflation begin to pick up. So I think that the reason why stocks reacted so favorably to it is because, really, the asset purchase program wasn't affecting the stock market all that much. It maybe was here or there on the margin, but what they took with the left hand, they gave with the right with that enhanced forward guidance, and that was just a much more powerful blow. Does the market need continued Fed support to continue its run in the new year? Does the stock market start to second guess what's happening at any point here? Yeah, I think the only way that the stock market is going to second guess the Fed's support, because the Fed is going to be there to support them no matter what. They've already made it very clear that when they withdraw support, it's going to be very gradual and very measured. And so I think that as long as they keep to that script, it they shouldn't be adding to volatility. But the thing that could make people question uh, whether or not the Fed is going to still be there to catch them is what if we see inflation begin to rise. Because I think that the Fed really wanted to pivot away from talking about the unemployment rate because they care about it obviously, but there's very little they can do about it and shift from the, the unemployment rate towards inflation. So if all of a sudden we see inflation beginning to pick up, then the stock market might begin to question the Fed's support. But in my forecast, I don't see the rate of inflation picking up anytime soon. So I put that as a very remote possibility.